mixed feelings about what ACT UP did inside the church. I don't like Cardinal O'Connor. I do not believe in his politics, but I will respect a church for what it is. People were afraid of us. That's what made us. Drug companies did what we wanted them to do because we had gone into St. Patrick's. We were no longer the limp wristed effeminate person. We were men in jeans and boots who will infiltrate a mass. Stop killing us! We're not gonna take it anymore! You're killing us! Stop it! Stop it! ACT UP came about um, I guess I'd learned a lot from my GMHC experience and I was determined that it not be repeated in the ACT UP experience. And I'd also realized that organizations are going to become what they're going to become. They're like kids. After a while, you can, you can only form them so much. After a while, you know, they have personalities and bodies and they grow up and, and uh, you can't send the whole world to therapy. Um, so we attempted to make ACT UP everything that GMHC wasn't. There were an awful lot of people dying, more and more, and there were younger people dying. And ACT UP was, in essence, a much younger organization. Uh, a lot of terrified kids, and I think that um, there, have to, there has to be moments in time when people will respond on a gut grassroots level to something and and there was a lot of terror and anger by a younger generation who were much more comfortable with their homosexuality than even the, the people 10 years or five years earlier seven years earlier who started GMHC I mean the people who were in ACT UP were not like Paul Popham um, fine a man as he was who was he was in the closet these were kids who were most of whom had been to college and who had been in gay groups in college and, and uh, you know, were much more out there. And they had a lot of energy and they had a lot of brains. And the first uh, 87 to 91 of ACT UP, I think, was probably one of the great peak moments in gay history of, of togetherness, power, achievement, uh, the ability to work together, men and women. Um, and we achieved phenomenal results uh, before things, as most organizations, not gay or straight, do things turn in on each other or whatever. Um, it was very exciting. <laughs>